Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. So in this video, we are going to make a list of formulas related to arithmetic progression. So let us make a list and these formulas can be used when we are solving the problems. So the first one is in the list, the first one is terms of an AP. So let us make a list of terms of an AP. So the terms of an AP are A comma, A plus D comma, A plus 2D comma, A plus 3D comma, dash dash dash. So many terms are there. We cannot write all the terms. Therefore, these terms A comma, A plus D, A plus 2D, A plus 3D. So these are the terms of an AP. Then the second one is to find the nth term of an AP. So let us make a list to find the nth term of an AP. The formula to find the nth term is an is equal to a plus n minus 1 into d. So here an is the nth term or it is also called as nth term or it is called as lost term. And nth term is written as A and last term is written as L. So An and L both are same. An or L. Then A is the first term. Then N is the number of terms. And D is the common difference. So D is the common difference. So An is equal to A plus N minus 1 into D. So, so this is the formula to find the nth term of an AP. Next, to find the terms from the last terms. So terms na find out maadbeko L in the last term in the. However, we can use this formula. An is equal to L minus, L is last term, L minus N minus 1 into D. So we can use this one, An is equal to L minus N minus 1 into D. Next, this is used to find terms from the last terms, from the last terms. Yadu one term na kandidi veko. Yell in the last two term in the a term na kandidi veko. So next to find D. So to find the common difference. So common difference in a find out mar veko. To find the common difference we can use D is equal to AP minus AQ divided by P minus Q. Or we can use it to find the D. So D is equal to An minus A divided by N minus 1. So this is the difference of first and last term. So when they give the difference of first and last term, An minus A divided by N minus 1 will give us D, common difference. Or D can be find out by using AP minus AQ divided by P minus Q. Then to find the to find sum of n terms to find sum of n terms so to find the sum of n terms so we can use the formula Sn Sn means sum of n terms is equal to n by 2 into 2a plus n minus 1 into d so where where Sn is the sum of n terms, n is the number of terms, a is the first term, n is number of terms and d is the common difference. Or we can find out Sn by using Sn is equal to n by 2 into a plus an. Or Sn is equal to n by 2 into a plus l. So, an are use mark both, that way an and another body both, will I l and another body both. So, sn is equal to n by 2 into a plus an 
R S N is equal to N by 2 into A plus L. So this is you, this formula we have to use to find the sum of the N terms of an AP. Next, sixth one. So to find relation between to find relation between an comma sn and s n minus 1 so what is the relation between these three so an is equal to sn minus s n minus 1 so this is the relationship between nth term sum of the n terms and sum of the n minus 1 terms so this relation we should use then the seventh one to find to find sum of n natural numbers so if you want to find the sum of n natural numbers so we have to use the formula so let us use the formula to find the sum of n natural numbers so sum of n natural numbers Sn is equal to n by 2, sorry, Sn is equal to n into n plus 1 divided by 2. Sn is equal to n into n plus 1 by 2 or we can write sigma n. Sigma n will show sum of the n terms. So sigma n is equal to n into n plus 1 divided by 2. So, this is to find sum of n natural numbers. So, next. So, next one to find. To find sum of n odd natural numbers. To find sum of n odd natural numbers. So, n odd natural numbers can be find out by using, so Sn is equal to n square. Then, to find, to find sum of n even natural numbers. To find sum of n even natural numbers. So, even natural numbers can be find out by using Sn is equal to n into n plus 1. Next, to find three terms. When sum and uh, product of those three terms is given, to find three terms we can use. So, A minus D comma a comma a plus d so these are the three terms uh, we have to we have to use this form this formula to find the three terms of an ap a minus d comma a comma a plus d now to find four terms so to find the four terms we can use a minus 3d comma a minus d comma a plus d comma a plus 3d so these are the four terms of an ap to find four terms we can use a minus 3d comma a minus d comma a plus d comma a plus 3d now to find five terms so to find five terms we can use a minus 2d comma a minus d comma a comma a plus d comma a plus 2d so these are the five terms of an ap so ap find out madadike so we have to use these formulas so total 12 formulas na use madkondo we can find, we can solve the problems related to arithmetic progression so thank you for watching my youtube channel still those who are not subscribed my channel please subscribe it so those who already subscribed please watch my videos like my videos and share my videos and don't forget to press the bell icon to get the notification for the next video thank you very much for supporting my youtube channel once again thank you very much